वेलकम बैक टू आर यूट्यूब चैनल एंड वी आर वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द ओवरऑल लेट्स से इमोशनल स्टॉक रिएक्शन टू स्पेस एंड वॉट मैनी आर आस्किंग एंड स्लोली लूजिंग फेथ इन टू द कंपनी बट इट्स नॉट स्पेसिफिक टू स्पेस इट्स अबाउट द ओवरऑल मार्केट वी विल टॉक अबाउट डे ट्रेडिंग वी विल टॉक अबाउट द स्टॉक चार्ट सो स्टे ट्यून बिकॉज दिस इज मे बी सिंस मैनी मैनी मंथ ऑफ द मोस्ट मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट वर्ड्स इन गैलेक्टिक फ्राइडे ओके एंड आई जस्ट एज अ रिमाइंडर देर इज अ लिंक इन टू डिस्क्रिप्शन सो गाइज ओके फाइव एंड let's uh, let's uh, dive in it and uh, just the ultimate tool that you can have right now in the in in this choppy waters so without further to you let's dive in holy moly and i am not i am not talking about the dance enhancement uh, powder that you can shallow and you are in good mood i am taking about the markets let's type in first into the market to explain the overall picture uh, the space uh, 500 since about mid of march and uh, uh, just doesn't stop to fall okay so we we see 4600 level then we saw 4400 we saw 400 uh, 4200 we saw 4000 breaking and now we are somewhere around 3900 and it seems that we drop even uh, even to 3850 what does it means for uh, for the overall market well at some point uh, there will be a technical bounce back and uh, uh, a lot of this is uh, based on market cycle everything in the uh, everything in the world is based on cycle uh life cycle econ- economical cycle right boom you know greed cash you know like kind of a spring and again okay and in economic cycle you see that those of uh, you uh, uh, you look uh, backward are pretty accurate okay and let me tell you the following and i'll show you the following look at this graphic this is a market cycle that exactly uh, predicted that uh, last year was the highest of the height and you remember bitcoin at you know 70 dollar almost you know and uh, space 500 almost all time high and the uh, and then we start to drop and if you are looking now zoom zoomed in into the second graphic here you see that the current market cycle show the kind of bottom now sometime in may and we should see kind of into june but there is the worst over now absolutely not and that's why you sh- uh, that's why you should be careful going now all in i will tell you that uh, why you should be careful going now all in and i will tell you exactly how i do uh, i do it now now first of all you'll see like a recovery into the summer before the big big dump the final capitalization uh, and we didn't show uh, didn't solve yet many retail investors saying i will sell now it doesn't make sense you know but uh, this is not capitalization this is like retail capitalization then there is a hedge fund capitalization where the hedge fund because they are over leverage they need just to pay all the money back to bank whatever and then you have the institutional capitalization so i think towards the end of the year maybe september october with the um, seasonality of the stock market those uh, are the worst month so anyway financial crisis for for example started in september and then then we should see maybe a recovery in 2020 so what i am doing uh, i think about it in term of space let's have a look into space if we are looking into space you are seeing that it also followed the um, oval mark they recovered a little bit to 11 but then since 11 we lost about 51% so i have a certain experience and i just saw in the end of last year i saw it a little bit coming so i started to research what are the best strategies 
and i now developed a strategy that i am sharing with uh, hundred of people and they are making so much money you should follow me on instagram this uh, i am sharing those games there you know what i am think my thought really here uh, my instagram follow me there and make sure to check it out i know it's okay obviously because if we have a geopolitical tension the war next to europe we have raising uh, rates we have reducing of the balance lead we have a very low volume into the market which give us the crazy spike and all of that is obviously heavy on market because the market was basically on steroids on the last two years the feds was pumping people so the greed in them you know everything went up you saw all of that pumping everything virgin galactic things like having a tremendous potential put on the price targets that it it should reach just in a couple of year it reached in month and obviously as higher the goals and lower it can fall so what goes very high also goes very 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 low so don't forget a stock that fall already 80% can fall another 80% so it's nothing said that we have the bottom here but slowly because the market cap of the stock is around 1.4 billion dollars but they have around 1 billion in the uh, in the bank or 1.2 uh, billion dollar don't know the exact number but basically at some point we will reach most probably the valuation lower than the cash in the bank obviously you know 50 million is getting burned every now for the operation every quarter as we saw in the last year earnings but still they have a big big cushion smash uh, sapo to smash i know people don't like him but he prepared this company perfectly for this downturn so let me tell you that uh, raising money in this market is very very hard did that already very very smart because they have very experienced people richard branson smash you know you know all of these people are lived through different cycle through the cra- uh, through uh, through cash uh, so they said okay you know fed is raising and i said this also in a second video a couple of month ago or even two year ago i said i said there is one thing i am very scared of uh, if the fed will raise rates now this was the pop of the dot com bubble this was the pop of the housing market it's so like uh, history never repeat but uh, it has a pattern and uh, i lived uh, through a couple of them already so i'm prepared okay thanks for watching my video guys